Hello everyone, welcome again. And uh, today I'm going to show you one more project, which is called the jewelry jewelry shop management. So in this project, I'm using the JSP and servlets on the uh, front end. I'm using JSP and some HTML code inside the JSP. Uh, you can see right here the JSP folder. And for the validation, I'm using JS JavaScript and some images folder. Uh, images. I'm separating the uh, images in this folder and some forms and CSS for the style part and you can see inside the JSP we are using some HTML for the designing part so similarly for the server side language I'm using the servlets so and it is the complete MBC architecture you can see here to build tool I'm using the Maven tool which is uh, responsible to contain all the libraries of the project so let's see the demo uh, how it work and what is the functionality of the project so it is uh, basically a jewelry soap management system you can say how can a user purchase jewelry online so it was login already so this will be my home page of the application and you can see the home page as a header and uh, three slider in the header and some product which is already added in the system so as you can see the last I did products and this is the footer part so there is some categories like this is a home page and if you see the diamond and you click diamond so you will see the diamond products and you can uh, swap it like this and uh, if you want to see the gold product user can see the gold product and it's also categorized and if you want to see the silver product you can see the silver product so uh, uh, admin can add the data uh, from the backend like we are using the mysql database to maintain the data so there will be a two user of the um, two actor of the application you can see two user of the application the first one will be the admin and the second one will be the customer so uh, first of all i'm going to show you the how uh, admin can add a product and can manage the system so for now as an admin i'm going to log in, in the application so this is my admin account and by this account i can uh, go and add jewelry you can see the same home page admin also can see if admin wants to add some jewelry so you can add here so uh, the name is gem demo jewelry part 2 and you need to select the category like i'm going to select the category inside the silver and the weight is like uh, 450 gram and the price will be this and you can choose an image for my there will be image on the desktop no, 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 no. Yeah, I can use this image so you can see the image here and uh, here the description this is for demo this is a demo product you can see I'm gonna click on save Okay, I'm getting this error because uh, the path is not set yet for the uh, image folder. So first we need to add a path somewhere, some places like in the controller and jewelry detail controller or things jewelry controller. Here we need to set the path of the folder. This is the different path I think so how can we add the path here so just go on image folder right click and go on the properties and copy this complete path from here and just go it and save save this now again try now again try to add a product choose I'm going to reload this again 
and I have to log in the system again once the user will be logged in now add the jewelry jewel and 2 and select the category silver again the same price and all the things it's too high okay launch is image this is the image I download okay now this is a demo product You can see the data is saved successfully. Now just refresh the product uh, project for the image. So I'm gonna refresh the project here. You can see inside the image, the download image I think is there now. Yeah, download PNG. Yeah, you can see the image here. So uh, let's see the newly added project is uh, the product is added inside the silver category or not, and. Uh, Add one more functionality is there for admin. Admin can see the build details is uh, performing by the user. So you can say front end. Inside the silver category, we just added a product. You can see here the demo jewelry 2 and the, um, this thing in the view detail. You can see the name, price, rate, and total. And uh, as a user, if I want to purchase this, I have to click on the pay for purchase. We have to uh, log in in the application first. So first of all, I'm going to register in the application for the new user, and the login ID will be always a Gmail ID. So enter the Gmail. I think it's gmail.com, and I'm going to use some dummy password one two three, and the date of birth I have to enter here like this mobile number. Select the gender and the CD. And I click on the sign up before this. I have to copy the address. Yeah, user is registered successfully. Just check the register table. You can see the new entry here. And now I can log in the application and purchase that product. So I'm gonna just pick. And uh, wait, uh, I want to buy this project. I'm gonna view detail and pay now. I'm gonna log in this, and the password is 123. Now sign in. You can see the user is logged in successfully, and you can buy the product when you just click on pay. And you have paid successfully. If you want to print receipt, you can print the receipt as well with image and all the things. And you can change the PDF format of that. Uh, you can see some area and you can click on print uh, and user can log out the detail and I'm going to log in again with a admin user so you can check the build detail which is recently performed by the user so you can see I think the user demo is only two demo product test purchase by this user who to draw inside the database inside the database you can say the build table is also updated with the new entry and uh, the jewelry is also updated with the new jewelry which is uh, added by the yomethod.gmail.com and the image is also there so this is the complete shopping website for the jewelry and this is this project is only for the college students who want to uh, submit their minor major project or uh, someone who want to learn the Java development and want to set the uh, set an example want to check the example how Java things work and how we can use this so uh, as I told you this is complete MBC project which is following the model control view uh, architecture and developed we build on Maven and uh, as a technology it's using JSPN servlets uh, as a backend it's using MySQL and if you want source code just check the description box there is some detail so you have to go through the link and you have to contact on the particular ID or uh, email ID I will provide in the description so you can contact me on the email ID so I will provide the source code and even I will help you to configure this project at your machine so you need to pay you need to pay some minimum charges the charges will be uh, 
define in the description and it's not a high charges so just minimum charges for the support and thank you so much for watching this video if you like channel subscribe channel for more video if somebody needs project in java so you can contact with the code one and you can share the detail with them and if you have some product or uh, project or if you have some ideas to build project for your college you can contact in the below detail so i will provide that uh, project also and uh, minimum cost so thank you